install Scratch Junior not just on your phone, but also on Windows PC. The process is not that straightforward, but let's look into it. Scratch Junior is tailor-made for young children, ages 5 to 7. Its interface is simpler than Scratch. With it, children can express themselves in creative ways. Are you excited? Ah, previously, we have talked about how to install Scratch Junior with BlueStack. See the video link in the description box. We are going to make video for Scratch and Scratch Junior every Sunday. If you like this topic, stay tuned and keep watching. Google for Scratch Junior official website. On the page, you see the app is available on four platforms. Apple App Store, Google Play Store, Chrome Web Store, and Amazon. When we click on Chrome Web Store, if you are using a window PC, you will see it is not compatible because the app only runs on Chrome OS. So it is a dead end for us Windows user. For those of you who have an Android device, you can download the app from Google Play Store. It is a very easy process to install. Just like that, it is installed on my phone. Okay, now we're back to the hard part. How to get the app installed on our PC? We search for Scratch Junior for desktop, open source community port. There are two versions available, one for Mac and one for Windows. As of today, June 2020, there are only beta versions. I have just downloaded it. Let's double click on it. Wait a moment. And we will see take the blue guy. Wait a minute more. Yay! Now we can play with the app even offline. No internet connection is needed. When we are ready for our first project, let's click on the house. On this page, on the right side of the white paper, those are your previous projects. Click on the plus sign to start a new one. This is a new project. You can make animation, stories, or games. You see, take the blue guy is at the center of the stage. Under the stage, there is a palette of programming blocks. And below it is the programming area. This is where the magic happens. Let's try and drag down our first block. When we click on it, it will make the blue guy move in the direction of the arrow. Let us drag him back to the side of the stage. Hmm, I want to make him walk with a little jumpy dance. Like move up and down and a bit to the right. Let's try it. Let's move forward, up, down, forward. One more time. I wanted to repeat this routine without me clicking on it. Let's see how we can do it. We drag out the repeat block. Uh, I want the four, uh, the four blue blocks inside it. Yeah. And you see the number four on the orange block? It is going to repeat four times for me. Can you see? Now let us drag out the green flag. So this animation will start when I click on the green flag at the upper corner of the stage. Don't forget the red end block. All right, let's choose a background. Since I think Mr. Take looks like an alien, so I choose the moon for him. Let's try again. Hmm, I like it. Let's see if we can add another character in this animation. Hmm, let's say a rocket. Alien and a rocket. What a team. At this moment, the rocket is blocking Mr. Tick. Let's move it aside. The rocket is selected and we can start to program it. First, we drag out the green flag. Now, we choose a movement for it. 
Say move down one step. Mm, one step. Uh, it's a little bit. I want three, three steps. And end block. Hmm. Let's try. Okay. When I click on the green flag, both characters start their own animation. But I do not like how I do the rocket animation. Let me throw the movement away. Mm, then I want to make a new one. Let's say, um, instead of moving down, I want it to move up. Not just one step, it's a bit little. Three. Let's make it three. Put back the end block. Now it's much better. Mr. Tick is getting down from the rocket. At least in my imagination, I want Mr. Tick to walk across the moon, not just stop at the center. Let's see, eight. Yeah. Go, 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 go. Yeah. What do you think? Now I want to add one more scene. Just like another chapter in a story, if you wish. In this chapter, I would just need him to move straight forward. Very easy. The green flag and motion block. Um, let's make it 11, maybe. And then, yes. Good. Okay. We need an end block too. You see, there is a block for us to change the scene. But for now, we will just use the normal end block. Let's try. Whoops! It's ended. Why Mr. Tick is not moving into the other scene? It's because we used the end block. Let's make it disappear and we snap in the other scene block. Let's go to page 2. Let's see, let's see, wait for it. Mm, voila, it is changed. Okay, page is turned, but page is blank. Let me add a background. How about a bitch? Nice sun, nice wave. Try again. Jump, 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 jump. Mr. Tick is going to the beach. Yay, he is on vacation. Don't forget to save our story, our project. Let's name it. I want to name it. Landed on the moon. Hmm. Is it a good name? Okay. This is our first project. We are going to upload another video on next Sunday which is either in Cantonese or English. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. We also upload Tas Pink drawing video every Thursday. Subscribe to our channel. See you next time. Bye-bye.